Hey everyone, welcome to another episode of Lucklight Plays. Uh, we're continuing our run through of Secret of Evermore and hopefully finishing it. Uh, on the last episode, we traveled down into uh, our enemy butler robot Carlton's, um, I guess, hidden base here. And uh, where he put us through quite a gauntlet of raptors and rimsalas and clones of ourselves. Uh, after defeating the clones, uh, that was what the end of the episode, so here we are, continuing on. Oh, he's blowing up his TVs. And here comes Magmar. Now the thing about Magmar is that if you don't kill him in a certain time frame, the room itself heals him. So I'm going to use everything I have in destroying him. Which is why I built up all these spells and why I gathered so many ingredients. Doesn't matter now, so might as well finish them. Giving me a lot of trouble back in the day. Uh, not, and I don't mean just in the volcano where you saw him, but uh, I remember not doing it fast enough and the room healing him. And that was it for me, and uh, it was so aggravating. This uh, healing animation doesn't help me here. Alright, but Nitro, there it is. Really glad I stocked up. Come on. Fall. He's healing. How do I. How did I not do it? I'll just keep trying. There we go. Got him that time. Oh, hello. Here is the final boss. Who has a trick to him. Barrier makes you invincible to all of his attacks. It's really sad. I think Magmar is the true boss there. So, let's just take our time and defeat him. You'll notice I'm taking no damage to anything. So as long as I keep Barrier up, the game's pretty much won. I think uh, Carlton's robot here is uh, riding a rocket or a machine gun. Hit him, dog. Oh, whoops. Oh, barrier wore off. Immediately took damage. trying to fight this guy back in the day without barrier. Because barrier is actually a spell you can miss and not be able to pick up. Uh, if you go after Tiny before uh, talking to Horus, uh, you lose out on the spell. And without it, this guy is actually really tough. So it's very easy to get hit by his rockets and his 
You can't stand on side of them usually because of all the explosions. So it involves a lot of dodge work, a lot of fancy footwork. And a lot of healing, which I've pretty much exhausted. I could have used barrier earlier in the game, uh, earlier in this uh, gauntlet, but I didn't want to cheap out the entire boss battle. <laughs> Magmar still would have been able to hit me. Yeah, let's, let's use some spells. Luckily this guy doesn't heal himself. Oh, that didn't work very well. How about bees? Will bees be what defeats him? No. Crush. Nope. Let's just stick to what we're doing then. Gain a level out of it. Not that it matters anymore. Is he trying to attack me with a flashlight? <laughs> Why didn't you just do that in the first place? has left the building. Projectomatic Zeptron Simulator. <laughs> Why does every professor and every scientist have to talk like that? We'll just twist this knob and pull this lever. That should do it. Oh, looks like all the monsters are disappearing. Apparently unplugging your butler. But now that I think about it, why? Like I could see I could see the bats. They could they can go away. But why would things like snakes uh, snakes, um like spiders and raptors and stuff disappear? Because they were part of the culture. They were part of the jungle culture, they were part of the desert. Oh, and now that place is starting to shake apart. Monster Quake. By the way, this is all automated now. I, I have no control. <laughs> so you need evil in the world for it to function? Is that what you're saying to me? So instead of pacing, how about we go and get them? Come on, let's go. Stop waiting around. <laughs> Controllers now. <laughs> Gotta carry the three. Come 
on. <laughs> Let's go. this thing without I say. to hug. Alright, the sky has turned a puke green. I think that's uh, your hint to move it. that uh, shaking the world apart doesn't make the colors of the world start spinning wildly. <laughs> Cat. 
Please don't make a pun. Hey, dog's fine. See the movie? The Secret of Evermore. Great. So ends The Secret of Evermore. Pretty fun game. I think it's pretty unique. Uh, the music is phenomenal. I, I can't get enough of that. Uh, my, my game obviously has a little few glitches there with that black box on the sky there. But, uh, um, you know, it had a lot of uh, unique things that you could do. Uh, the alchemy system, I think, was pretty unique. Uh, for the time, uh, I think there have been a few other instances of it pop up afterwards. Um, you know, it was made entirely in America, which you really didn't see back in the day. Back in the day, every single RPG or every game, pretty much every game you played, whenever there was a, a credit thing, it had it was Jeremy Soul. Uh, you had just a whole bunch of Japanese names, and that's it. Uh, you know, um, Americans could make good games even back in the day, uh, but this game got a lot of a lot of hate that it didn't uh, it didn't really need or really deserve. But. Other than that, I mean, you know, you had Secret of Mana, and that's why Secret of Evermore took a lot of heat, because it wasn't Secret of Mana. I actually played this one before Secret of Mana, so, you know, maybe that's why I liked it more than others. Special thanks to our families. Aww. And there you go. That was the game. Uh, there is actually a couple things after the credits. Uh, it takes a couple minutes, so I'm going to hit the speed button, so forgive me on the, the sound. Sounds gonna mess up a little bit here. I think it happens like a couple minutes. There we go. <laughs> That's a good robot. Doing the hand wringing. <laughs> yeah, that is the end, though. There, there was never anything after it, which is very unfortunate because I think a Secret of Evermore two would have been really, really good. Different characters, etc. Um, there is actually something after this too. Uh, it happens about maybe a half hour after. If you leave this on for that long, uh, there's an extra like bonus credit. So let me see if I can speed up and get to it. I gotta be careful. Let's see. I don't want to miss it. Hmm. 
Maybe not. Still going. Oh, I missed it. Crap. <laughs> I'll, uh, I might go back and slow that down. But, alright, yeah, that's it. So, uh, hope you enjoyed this, uh, run through of Secret of Evermore, and, uh, on the next episode, we'll start a new game. So, uh, hope you come back for that. My name is Lucklight, thank you for watching, and have a good one.